I'm a celebrity. Get me out of where? Hey. Yeah. Come on, Asha. Say it like you mean it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. Yeah. I think we're going to leave that for Ant and Jack. So, yeah. hi, guys. Welcome back to our channel. And here with us today, we are going to present to you that I am a celebrity. Get, na- get me out of here. Is back. 2020 Mm -hmm. and this is the cast okay so as you can see there's Anton Deck the presenters and um, this year instead of it being in the Australian countryside it is set in a in north in a castle in northern Wales yes it's back in Wales and this time it's going to be cold (laughs) yeah Take it away. Okay, so first we have Vernon Kay, a TV presenter. His phobias are being confined underwater. The biggest misconception to dispel in the castle is, I think I've always been the same throughout my career, so I don't have any. His role in the camp is, person to keep the books out. The person who he misses most is his family. His dream campmate is anyone who's won the Super Bowl and his relationship status is married. And being a TV presenter, I cannot wait to see how Vernon K is going to look in that cold with all those mugs and, you know, everything. Anyway, take it away, my friends. Number two, Victoria Derbyshire, broadcaster and journalist. Her phobias are spiders, confined spices, confined spaces, and being lost in <laughs> spaces. The biggest misconception is I don't think I have any of people who know me just as the news and current affairs person. Her role in the camp is shoulder to carry on. She mostly missed her boys, her husband, her dog, and her mum. Her dream cabinet is Madonna, Gary Linker, and Jamie Oliver to cook for us. I think you would really have, you would, you could really have some geeky chats with them. And her relationship just is married. I don't know her, but I, I can't wait to get to know her. So moving on to Jordan North, who is the TV, no, sorry, Radio wait. 1 DJ presenter. His phobias are pretty much everything. I don't think he's going to do well in this. We hope that everybody does well. Let's not jinx it. Let's not jinx it for anybody. Take it away, my friend. The biggest misconception is on his Radio 1 show, he's always bubbly and energetic, but everyone has down moments too. So he wants people to see what he's really like. His role in the camp will be entertainer, and his dream campmate is Barack Obama, and his relationship status is single. I think he's my favorite. Yeah. Moving on to my, yeah, no, <laughs> I don't know. I don't have any favorites. Sam Farah, CVE Olympic champion or Il- Olympic legend, fastest long distance runner. Okay, so his phobias are any animals that move, and the biggest... And what do you say about that? Any <laughs> animal that moves, and you're going in a jungle, or this time, a castle? A human is an animal. <laughs> I know. Carry on. Okay, um, the biggest misconception is it'll be nice for people to see him doing something other than running. He's going to be the cook. He missed coffee, his wife and children. I think I can't wait to see Mofara doing something else other than running because he's always been on the run. Next, Next is Beverly Collard, Corey Icon. I have loved seeing Beverly on the television in Corey Street or oh, Coronation Street. But I can't wait to see her in the castle eating. Oh, Insects only God knows what. <laughs> insect sandwiches, probably. Indeed. Oh, yes. I can't wait and for that insect sandwich. <laughs> this isn't very good for her because her phobias are ghosts and insects. No way. <laughs> How dare you go in the jungle when you're scared of insects? 
I think you're going to do very well, Beverly. I am right, and we are right behind you. You will do just fine. And she is the cleaner. Okay. She's going to be well cleaning those, <laughs> you know, insects. insects. Yeah, Giovanni Fletcher, author and podcaster. Her phobia is heights. A pretty common one. Oh my days. I love seeing those who have a phobia for heights. Because <laughs> can you imagine when they go up there and then they, they, they have to, oh, are they going to be flying out of an aeroplane? I don't know, but this is something I'm looking forward to. I always to. wanted to skydive. I know. I'm always looking forward to... <laughs> <laughs> I'm a celebrity get me out of here because I just love to see them suffer I yeah. think you also do guys it's nice to see other people suffer <laughs> in a good way though in a good yeah. way yeah okay so she's gonna be the mom friend and giver of hugs I don't think you're gonna be doing that no no hugs <laughs> social distancing my friend moving on AJ Pritchard ballroom dancer ah, you're my favorite everybody's my favorite this Honestly, guy, this guy was on Strictly. I know. I've loved seeing you dancing. All oh, that ballroom moves. They just mm -hmm. pass it. Now I cannot wait to see AJ dancing mm -hmm. in that jungle. I mm -hmm. hope you will show us some tricks and tips. We might learn a thing or two. His phobias are heights and he's claustrophobic. claustrophobic. The biggest misconception is people see him with sparkles and thick hands. But no one knows what he's really like. He's going to be the person to keep morales up. He misses his warm and comfy bed. I mean, he doesn't. Already? <laughs> oh my. <laughs> you just be ready for those cold nights in that castle. If I was there, I'd, <laughs> I'd give the hammer. I would have to sleep in one of those. Right. So next is Shane Ritchie. He is an actor and a former East Ender. I have loved seeing Shane Ritchie on the screen. Green, all oh my days with Bianca. <laughs> so I cannot wait to see you in that castle, my friend. I think you're one of my favorites. We went to see him uh, playing in one of the theaters. Anyway, tell us more about him. His phobies are human faces, which is pretty much a fancy word for saying leftover poo. Oh dear. I cannot wait to see you clean it up with your hands, my friend. Because <laughs> yep. those toilets there ain't going to clean themselves. Okay, his biggest misconception is nothing. And he's going to be the person who will ruin everything. And we move on to Holly. I think we got carried away. Moving yeah. on to Holly Arnold. He, she is a Paralympic gold medalist. Tell us more about Holly. Her phobia is spiders. A pretty classic one. Yes, and one of those. Actually, those are very popular in the jungle. So That's I cannot wait to see you scream, Holly. <laughs> we don't mean that in a bad way. In a good way. And we'll keep voting for you. <laughs> yep. Well, mum will. Well, yeah. We yeah. both will. Well. Oh, well, I, I can't. It's illegal. <laughs> I okay. think I'll be voting for whoever. Well, I've never voted, but I think I might just do that this time round. Last but not least, Jessica Plummer, an actress and another former EastEnder. Yeah, I think EastEnders are taking over, don't you? They <laughs> always take it, they yeah. always take it. But I am supporting any of you guys, I'm right behind you, we are right behind you all. Mm -hmm. And we hope that may the best woman or man or king or queen of the castle win. So tell us more about Jessica Plummer. She has arachnophobia. What phobia? Arachnophobia. Fear arachnophobia. Fear she is. She has fear of heights. Can you imagine that? Yeah. So we cannot wait. Oh my goodness! Enjoy. Guys.